Hi everyone, it's Lizzie Vapes. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a post review of my blonde girl, so they call her, from the Pink Raspberry. Um, I paid $25 for this painting. It's a 50, it's a 40 by 50. I really enjoyed working on it. I loved all the pink and pastel colors with the gray. It took me a while to do this one because I had other projects on the go in between. So if I count how much I worked on it, it probably all together probably would have been two weeks. But because I stopped to do other projects, it did take me a little longer to do. I can't get it all in frame, but I will put a video that will be on the beginning of it to show the whole entire picture. I can try to, like, I don't know if I can. The bottom half here. But I will take a picture of the whole thing, video, and post it in the front with the way the camera's angled, and I'm just too lazy to get a different camera angle, I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, it turned out really pretty. I thought there was dragonflies in this picture, but maybe I was mistaken. But I know you can get this on AliExpress too from the Every Moment store. Every Moment sells it in a square. This is a round and I have lots of drills left over from this kit. Drills in every color, so they give you lots of Minus those ones over here. These ones over here are my for my keychains. But as you can see, lots left over in the bottom of my containers. So I really enjoyed it. Canvas quality was good. The clarity was good. Overall, it was all good, and I enjoyed working on it, and that's about it for this post review, other than the drills were great, the canvas is great. I like these canvases from the one supplier. This one came from China. This is not printed in Canada. This is still one that come from her supplier that, and I like their canvases for the simple fact that they don't fray at all. I like that a lot about her supplier. But now I'm pretty sure everything is going to be printed in Canada. I have one that I'm working on currently right now. It's a custom. That was printed here in Canada. I haven't gotten very far on it, just a little bit, but I don't know if I'm, I might do a look and chat with it, but I don't know yet because I want to kit up one from AliExpress that I have. I wanna, I wanna do a square. I haven't done a square in a while. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna kit up a square. So I'm gonna de-kit this one in the Harbor Freight containers because I only have two until my cousin comes down. And then I will kit up the next one and for my Take Tuesday, it will be the new kit that I that I just kit up this morning. Sorry if lighting's bad, but it is maybe five o'clock in the morning here. <laughs> and I wanted to get this out before I kit up. I want to use these containers. So here you have it. Long Girl from the Pink Raspberry. I'll leave her description down below. She has a Facebook page. If you want to order from her, you just send her an instant message and you tell her what you want. If you want a custom, you send her the picture and then she'll tell you if they can do it or not. And pretty much like anywhere else. They, their website is not up and running yet, but once it is up and running, it'll probably run a lot smoother. But right now, 
she is on Facebook. I know that for Canadian, all you have to do is e-transfer her the money. For American, I'm not sure how she's doing that one. I'll have to ask her. If I go down to the Pink Raspberry in my next two days off, I will ask her. But right now, you can contact her on Facebook. On um, It was called Diamond Painting Strathroy. I think it's Pink Raspberry, formerly known as Diamond Painting Strathroy. I think that's what it comes up with. But I'll leave the link down in this description. So here you have it. I think it turned out beautiful. The girls are awesome. I didn't have very much garbage at all. Of course, I didn't save any of my garbage for this one because I had so many projects on the go, but very little. If anything, it was just some that had a little bit of an overhang. And I probably, to tell you the honest truth, threw it back in the container because I'm not one or I threw it on my table. I am bad for having drills all over this table. You don't even know. After project, when I clean up, I got to clean up. I don't know how many drills off this table, but it wasn't, there's barely any garbage. And there you have it. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I'm having a hard time here with the camera angle. And if you like, please subscribe to my channel. I be super tickle pink. I, over the weekend, have gotten a lot of subscribers and I, it's so awesome. I'm super excited and I hope you all continue to join my crazy journey here on YouTube. And I still want to create awesome content and I can't wait till I get some mail so I can do some more unboxings that isn't just the pink raspberry because I do want to show you more products than just the pink raspberry. So there you have it. I hope everybody has a great day. And remember, a little dabble do ya. And see you next time. Bye everyone. Mm -hmm.